This is the Solar PV100 from Seward, the world's first multifunction PV installation tester. It's part of a full test kit, which includes everything required to test to the new IEC 62446. I'm going to show you how easy it is to use the Solar PV100 on an installed and operating PV installation. Before commencing any testing on the installation, it must first be isolated. To switch on the tester, hold down the RPE and Auto keys for a couple of seconds. The first test I will perform is an earth or ground continuity test. Connect the test leads with detachable crocodile clips to the tester. Link the crocodile clips together and press the NULL key to zero out the test lead resistance. I've connected one test lead onto the main earth or ground terminal on the building. I connect my second test lead onto the exposed metal work on the PV panels. Press the RPE key and I have my continuity reading. Next, the open circuit voltage, short circuit current, and insulation tests will be performed. Remove the DC output connectors which come from the array to the inverter. In this case, the array uses MC4 connectors. So, connect the MC4 test adapters to the tester and connect the other end to the array. As soon as the array is connected to the tester, it will sense the incoming voltage and display the open circuit voltage on the screen. Use the insulation test voltage button to choose the correct output voltage for the array. In this case, we're using 500 volts. Press the auto key to begin the test sequence. The short circuit current and insulation resistance tests are performed sequentially. When a measurement appears on the screen, the results can be stored by pressing the store key. If the array under test has several strings, we can repeat this measurement for each string, connecting the tester to each DC output connectors in turn, taking the measurement. Once the test is complete, we remove all of the test leads. Once the results have been stored, the Recall button can be used to show test results on screen. If there is more than 5% variation between measurements taken on each string of the array, a warning icon will flash on the screen to notify you. To measure the DC operational current of the array, connect the supplied solar AC-DC current clamp to the PV100. Select the current clamp function by pressing the auto key until a current clamp icon appears on screen. Clamp the current clamp around the DC conductor. The tester will display the operating current measurement. Solar PV testing at the press of a button.